Hi, welcome back. We got two systems have coming our way from out west, heading straight for the Lone Star State. The first one is already making its way through Wyoming and Utah, Nevada. The second was still offshore for the Baja, California, but they should be here joining up forces to give us a shot at some rain as we head into the Friday afternoon time frame. Right now, we're still under the bridge of that high pressure that's sitting in the mountains all the way back down to the Gulf of Mexico right now. So our our days just continue to be very quiet for us. Uh, we are beginning to warm up a little bit as we anticipated that high pressure ridge is beginning to give us uh, warmer readings and shift those winds around. Almost 80 degrees this afternoon in Salado. We did hit 80 in Robinson this afternoon and 80 degrees as well with our weather, wa weather watchers in Limestone County to Debbie Fulmer. They're reporting. Now you're at 46 in Waco, 56 though in Meridian. Same thing for Hamilton and Goldthwaite. You're 61 in Gatesville right now. 57 in Bahia and Fairfield. Cooler by <laughs> quite a bit. 49 degrees right now in Centerville. At the airport, you look at the clear skies in 46. Humidity level has climbed back to 61% thanks to the winds taking more of a south uh, turn. They're still out of the west and southwest, so it's fairly dry, but the moisture is on the increase across the area and the barometric pressure beginning to drop a little bit, an indication that low out west is getting closer to us. Here's what's going to happen. Now, low out of the Pacific Ocean uh, off the Baja comes cruising in here. It kind of loses a lot of its punch, but it is picking up lots of moisture and spreading it out ahead of the next front coming through. That's the one from the northwest coming in, and that's the one that's going to give us uh, maybe a little squall line, but it does not look like it's going to be severe weather on Friday afternoon. Clear and cool tonight, 41 the overnight low, and our winds southwest 5 to 10 miles an hour. Tomorrow, winds more southerly, 10 to 15 and gusty, with a high getting back up to around 76 after that morning low of 41. So the front comes rolling in on Friday, probably going to see maybe some patches of light mist and drizzle early in the morning on Friday, but more likely widespread shower activity by afternoon. Cruising on through the Brazos Valley by Friday night and clearing our area completely by Saturday. But we got another shot at rain coming in on Sunday and a possible third shot at rain. And I'm just saying possible right now because this is way down the road, but Tuesday could see about a 30% chance of showers as well. Sports in six 